What's up, y'all? It's Marlo again, bro. What's good with y'all, man? Hey, so we got news in that Floyd Mayweather next exhibition fight will be like I think New Year's or New Year's Eve against another little Jackie Chan looking ass dude. And uh, yeah, uh, I, I salute Mayweather, man. This this also proves that that Mayweather is not fighting many Pacquiao next, like some of you idiots think. But it's proved that him versus Manny Pacquiao is not happening next because, I mean, also Mayweather made an Instagram post, a picture of him or whatever, and he was like, I know my lane. I stay in my lane. And he was referring to the fight that he fighting uh, Jackie, Mr. Jackie Chan and shit. Um, he referring to him, saying he fight him. See, Mayweather is getting his bag just by fighting, man, this shit, come on, man, he fighting these dudes in like a three-round fight who who never really fought at this type of level that he on, even though he an older fighter, but these dudes weak as hell, and he fighting, he whooping their ass, he gonna be whooping their ass, he getting like $10 million paydays and shit like that, like, that's the life, bro, he, he, you know how these fighters is when they stop fighting, man, they got the itch to come back, man, they get bored. Yeah, all that money and all that shit, but the motherfucker love throwing them hands. You've been doing this shit for 30 years type shit. So, Mayweather had one of the best, one of the, had one of the smoothest, I ain't gonna say that, but he got, he had a good career because, I wouldn't say smooth because he had hand problems and, you know what I'm saying, he had the bomb arm dispute and he had, he had obstacles that he had to climb over, but, when it, I'm talking about like toward the end of his career, you know what I'm saying? He got like the smoothest like exit, exit game plan. You feel me? Most dudes gotta go out on their shield. You know what I'm saying? They gotta go out getting knocked out the ring. You know what I'm saying? They gotta go out all kind of ways because of certain problems, money problems, and other problems. You feel me? Promoter problems and shit like that they had. So it is what it is, and, and he. He, he finding a way to still make money and, and not be in a harmful type of situation. Because I'm over here going back and forth with my uncle about, let me see, he just told, he just said that Mayweather will come back. What you say? What you say? I said I think that he can beat like the Broners or the Thurmans. Oh, yeah. He said Mayweather can come back and beat Broner, Thurman, and a whole bunch of other motherfuckers and shit like that. I mean, I, I agree. But him fighting Thurman is still a, a, a dangerous situation, even though we know that would never happen. But I'm just saying, you know what I'm saying? Put y'all in the perspective of him actually getting in the ring to make big money. Like, you feel me? Like, he can beat Thurman, but at the same time, Pacquiao was able to have the power. See, uh, Floyd ain't got Anybody the... got the right power. Floyd, yeah, yeah, okay. You can say that he's juicing and whatever, you know what I'm saying? Shit like that, but... He ain't never got caught for two, so I can't really put that jacket on him. But at the same time, Floyd will go out with our point a lot of these dudes still. But at the same time, Floyd ain't been in the ring in hellas and, and taking them punches after not being in that ring, taking a puncher from a high level boxer. You know what I'm saying? His head gonna be snapping back. You know what I'm saying? He ain't used to getting hit like that. Even though he got one of the greatest defense, but he getting older, man, and he don't need to be in the ring with them dudes anyways, man. He, he, he ain't got nothing to prove. He made his paper. He ain't got nothing to prove. And this is one of the best after careers that you can have, do you? If if Roy Jones and, and, and a couple other motherfuckers, Lenora Hopkins and shit like that, if they had the option to do what they did, man, this truck man feels hella loud, bro. But if... If Bernard, Bernard Hopkins and Roy Jones Jr. and a couple other people had the option to do either what they did or go out like Mayweather, trust me, they had picked the Mayweather route. They had picked the Mayweather route. So I salute Mayweather for not getting any of dudes way, man, because I don't like all that old motherfucking um, trying to steal the shine and all that shit. I like that he's staying in his lane because this, this can be his lane. Keep beating these Keep beating these Jackie Chan's and Jet Lee's and shit like that. Keep whooping on their ass, boy, and, and get your paper. Stay from out of the light, man. 
the lights, the real lights. You feel me? The, the top of the top, where the, where the real dogs at. You, you know what I'm saying? Your Earl Spence, your Terrence Crawfords, and shit like that. Stay out their way, man. Let these dudes have they shine. So I salute them. Salute them for doing what he do. Feel me? Fighting these dudes, man. But I just want to give y'all my take on that, man. So that's 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 the rumblings. Mayweather, uh, a lot of people close to him been confirming this situation. Uh, him fighting uh, Jackie Chan on uh, New Year's Eve. <laughs> so, shit. That's that, man. I'm going to watch it. As long as Mayweather, I'm going to watch any fight that Mayweather in, I ain't going to lie, but uh, I would be mad as hell if he was trying to fight Pacquiao or something like that. I'll be mad. But So, that's that, y'all. I just want to give y'all my take on that, man. And I'm out. Peace.